We have updates on Naya Rivera's disappearance and Pop Smoke's murder investigation. Plus, Katy Perry reacts to claims that she's related to Taylor Swift. Hey guys, it's Allie for Hollywood Life with your music roundup, starting with an update regarding the late rapper Pop Smoke. TMZ reports the LAPD arrested three men and two minors involved with his murder. Two of the men, Corey Walker and Keandre D. Rogers, are booked for murder, while another man, Jaquan Murphy, is facing an attempted murder charge. Their bail is set at $1 million each. Info on the two juvenile suspects has not been released. According to some other outlets, Pop Smoke's killers don't know him personally and seem to have targeted him after his address was posted online. Switching gears to pop stars now, Katy Perry just opened up about her rekindled friendship with Taylor Swift and responded to a fan theory claiming that they're somehow related. During an interview with Capital Breakfast with Roman Kempt, it was mentioned there was a rumor going around that the two pop stars are ninth cousins. Katy responded saying, well, we fight like cousins. Despite the fan fiction, Katie joked around saying she'll try to get blood tests done with Taylor to see if there's any truth to the theory. This just made me realize I need Katie and Taylor to do a drunk Q&A. That'd be incredible. But alright, let's talk about Naya Rivera and the latest updates regarding her disappearance. Recall it was reported her four-year-old son Josie was found alone on a boat in Lake Piru, California. CBS LA reports Josie told investigators he was swimming with his mother but she never got back into the boat. Law enforcement has revealed that Naya is presumed to be dead and search has shifted from rescue to recovery. Now the Ventura County Sheriff's Office has reported that more than 80 people are now involved in finding her body utilizing helicopters, boats, and specialized dive teams. And now the Ventura County Sheriff's Office has released footage of Naya and Josie going out to the boat launch before heading out to the lake. Since the news broke about Naya's disappearance, local residents have voiced their anger, requesting better safety measures in the area. According to TMZ, residents have made it known that many people have been injured or died in Lake Piru because swimmers are clueless about how dangerous it is. Apparently, it's not a man-made lake and there's a lot of debris and trees below the water and swimmers can easily get hurt or even entangled. Over 12,000 signatures are on a petition requesting warning signs to be put up for those entering the lake and to make tourists more aware of the risk they are taking by swimming in the lake. For the latest on this story, make sure you have hit the sub, like, and bell button so you can stay up to date on all the latest. And you can follow me on social media at Ali Stegnita. Bye, guys.